Hey, it's Clay again, and I'm going to show you how to get in a pelican that you're not supposed to get into on Halo 2. It's on, say, Metropolis again, just like my Scarab one. And, yeah, so if you played the level, you'll see why I cheat. All right. By the way, you don't have to do it in the Warthog, you can do that on the Scorpion. I'm just doing it on the Warthog because that's what I do usually. By the way, like driving the warthog into the tunnel or using the warthog is not necessary. You just gotta get past level, just whatever you do. So it doesn't really matter. So after the ghosts are done and stuff, and uh, the phantom's gone, and all the wraiths are done and stuff, and the pelicans come and drop off the marines and stuff, um, you'll want to drive the warthog up there, and um, to where the pelican, like where the marines get off. So drive it up to there, stay on top of the warthog, stand on top of it, and uh, start jumping and holding down blue. You only have to like jump once and hold down blue, and then. You'll be riding in the pelican, and it'll fly some distant to di some distant land. Yeah, I'll show you. Come on. 
It's after the, it's after the Phantom leaves, so yeah. So the way I did that, I jumped up while standing on the warthog kind of jumped into the uh, pelican and hold down blue. Also known as X, this button right here, blue. There's a marine command post in that building. We'll need to Shoot and that no one will get hurt. Everyone's invincible, nothing happens. Don't worry, that's supposed to happen if it starts to crash. Pelican, it calls the pelican a banshee. It says hold blue to flip pel to flip banshee. Now, I don't think you can drive it ever, but I mean you can try. I just don't think you can. So that's how you get in the Pelican and Halo 2 that you're not supposed to get in. Alright, thanks for watching.